So here we are again with Paper Mario Pro Mode Luigi's Challenge. I'm on chapter three now, and was there anything I needed to do before I went ahead with this? I was thinking about trading in my star pieces for badge, but I'm gonna wait until after chapter three and see what I'm at. <clears throat> after I do chapter three, get all the star pieces I can there, after I do Chuck's quizzes and, you know, whatever questions he's got and do that, then I'll go ahead and, uh, and see what I can get with all the star pieces I have. I didn't see anything. You can't see ghosts. They're not real. See? There's nothing there. Stop being afraid. But do I want to buy any items before I go in? You know what? Let me just quickly check out the item shop. Because I do have to deal with Tubba Blubba's heart. And Tubba Blubba's heart is actually probably going to be kind of tough. So I'm going to get these Thunder Ages. Because I know there's going to be, um... I think Tubba Blubba's heart has some... <clears throat> has some, uh, Hyper Goombas with him, or Hyper Para Goombas, if I remember correctly. He's not alone, so... I've got to keep that in mind, and also... I'm gonna grab, let's grab a couple Super Shrooms. And let's grab a couple of Dizzy Dials as well. Uh, I'm gonna keep the Repel Gel for now. Um, actually, you know what? Let me, let me get, okay, let me get rid of one of these Thunder Rages. Actually, let me get rid of two. And otherwise, I think I'll keep this stuff. Dizzy Dials, I think in the original, um, in, in the original version, they work uh, on Junior Troopa pretty well, if I remember correctly. Uh, in Pro Mode, who knows? It could have been severely nerfed. And I think all statuses, as I think I said in the previous part, have been nerfed to some degree. Also, what I'm going to do is I'm going to play this game and... Uh, get 900 something coins. I'm not going to show it since I showed it in the last part, or two parts ago. Um, but basically I'm just going to do what I got to do, save state, get 900 something coins. So uh, I'll update when I get that. Alright, so I got my 950 coins again. In no time at all. So I'm probably also going to pick up some life shrooms once I get to Boo's Mansion. Assuming they're still in, you know, in pro mode. They might not be. If they're not, then I'll have to deal with it then. But let's head into Chapter 3. Chapter 3, The Invincible, Tubba Blubba. Spoiler, he's not really invincible. Alright, so yeah, I'm just gonna go through this maze and, uh... Oh, let's not hit the fuzzy. And then I'll... I guess, uh... I guess I'll cut to when I get out of this place, because there's really not... I don't think there's anything different, um, with this one. Uh, in Pro Mode with Forever Forest and Pro Mode than there is in the original, so... It's pretty much the same thing. I'm gonna get this seed here. I'm also gonna get this HP+, plus in case I end up needing it. And also gonna get this FP+, plus in case I need it. Alright, so made it out of that maze, and... I'm sorry, forest. And now... We are in front of Boo's Mansion. Also, a vault room here, if I want to use it. Probably won't use it, but I guess I've got it. Hello, Bootler. All the way up top. Maybe I'll just climb up the outside of the mountain. I mean, mansion. I'll just climb up and uh, get up there and meet her that way. I guess we have to play their games, so let's do it. Let's play their games. I, wonder, I forget if Promo changed this up at all. Okay, so... Does he toss it around? No, so it's pretty much exactly like it was in the original. Oh, whoops. Uh, there we go. In fact, it is exactly like it. Maybe they were moving a little bit faster in the circle. Maybe. 
Maybe sped it up just a little bit. I wonder if this is any harder. That's fine. That's fine. I'm sure something in this whole thing will be harder than it was in the original. This is pro mode after all. Like this. This is most definitely going to be harder. It's got to be. It's got to be. Maybe they're going to toss it around super quickly. Super speeds. I won't be able to follow it. Surely that's what's going to happen, right? Okay, alright, maybe they're just warming up, gonna make it faster any second now. Any second now. Alright, this is easy too. Look at this. They didn't even bother, he didn't even bother changing this. Could have easily probably made it quicker. I say easily, but there's probably a lot to it that I do not know how to do, so I should not expect someone else to be able to. Probably. Anyway, let's get what's in here. Maple syrup. Actually, I needed the maple syrup, so that's good that I got it. Um, and there's a star piece here, too. Somewhere. There we go. I've got it. I knew I'd hit it eventually. I'm so good at this. And it's good, they sell life shrooms. So as soon as I get bow, I shall buy some. Oh, there's a star piece here too. Come to think of it, there's also a star piece down here. Almost forgot about. There's also one here. All right, to be honest, this one I had to look up. Look at this apple here. Which I do not want that badly, so we'll toss it aside. Success! And that's all the star pieces I can get here. Except I stupidly did that before I got the, um, the portrait. Or the... What the hell is this again? Boost portrait. Yes, a portrait. Exactly what I said. Yes, I will say hello to her for you. Not, you're just a portrait. Oh shit, I have to defeat Bo. I have to defeat the Queen of the Boos. I must destroy her to get the Star Spirit back. I must beat her because I do not care about her problems. All I care about is getting that Star Spirit. Because getting that Star Spirit is all- Oh shit, we're gonna help her with her problems, aren't we? I don't care about your problems, Bo. Th th these are your problems. I- I didn't do anything to- Tubba blubba. I don't care about him. I just want the star spirit. I'm gonna jump on you. Lady Bo is the biggest troll I've ever seen. But I'll, I'll troll her! Bo, come back here. Come back. Come on. Okay, line right up with me and... Alright, you're a ghost hammer goes through you. Heck, I can go through you, actually. See? You really are a ghost. Fascinating. Anyway, let's, uh, let's get on with this. I guess we have no choice but to help her. Mario has already decided that he will help her out. Okay, let's get these life shrooms. Oh, no, I can't get life shrooms. Let me, um... check some items. I'm gonna check, uh, actually I'm gonna check one of these super shrooms. I'm gonna check one of these dizzy dials. And I'm going to check... I'll check another super shroom. Let's get a few life shrooms. Make it so I never die again. I mean, well, I will die, but then I'll just get revived. It won't be a game over, is what I meant to say. Well, I could go fight Junior Troopa now. 
Which, maybe I want to do. Maybe I'll just want to get him out of the way. Actually, I'm going to wait on fighting him. And the reason is... Thank you, Bo, for going away. Um, the reason is that if I fight him now, I'm not going to just get my star power back, you know, like, after the battle. Like, after I fight Tubba Blubba and end the chapter and win, then all my star power gets granted back. I get a full heal and everything. And then I can go fight Junior Troopa at max health, max FP, max star power, everything. But if I fight Junior Troopa now, then I have to fight some enemies to get my star power back to where I need it to be for the fight with Tubba Blubba's heart. Because there aren't any beds or anything like that. And I'm probably going to use star power in the Junior Troopa fight, so... That's my reasoning. That's my logic. That's what I'm sticking to. I'll be honest, I was talking. Did I get the star piece that was here? Yeah, I was talking and wasn't paying attention, so... Good thing I got that. Let's make a save, let's get this very important coin, and then let's continue on. Very soon, Tubba Blubba will feel the wrath of Mario. Oh, I guess we're hiding. He will not feel the wrath of Mario just yet. I must wait until I discover what makes him not so invincible. Or what makes him invincible, so then I can stop that from making him invincible. Yes, that's that, that's what I gotta do. So, um... So now I can continue. And, oh, that's right, they put the fake, um, the fake clefts here. Fake rocks. To, to trip me up. Uh, that one over there is a real one, this one's a fake one. I don't know if that's a real one. Oh, that's a real one. Whoa! Is there a repel gel here? Um... Oh shoot, there's a repel gel here. And I don't really want the vault room. No, I don't want to fight you guys. You guys are nasty and I don't like you. I'm sorry, that's the best insult I've got. That's not a real one. See, I knew that wasn't a real one, because I'm a Paper Mario expert. I know all the insides and outs, and oh shit. How did I miss that? Oh shit. Oh shit! Look at this. Look at this. I'm getting... I'm getting all the enemies triggered. They're all triggered by my presence. Um, oh, uh, okay. All I wanted to do was get the star piece that's behind here. Well, I've made it to Tubba Lubba's castle, so let's head in. Oh, and these things are much faster, I remember that, so definitely need to get... Well, actually, wait, maybe they're not faster? Maybe that was something else? I know they are the Red Clubbas. The Red Clubbas are super fast. Aim fast enough, though. It's pretty damn fast. He's still pretty damn fast. Is there one in here, too? There is one in here. Sneak past this little guy. Just let him sleep. Let him dream. And let's also sneak past this guy because I'm just terrified of him. How did that not wake him up? Oh sh shit! Oh! Oh, uh, whoops. I actually didn't mean to do that. Can I beat him? No, you know, it's not even worth it. I'm just gonna run. 
Oh, actually a heart block, perfect. Okay, who am I gonna level up here? So assuming the heart still has, um, whoops, where is, all right. So assuming the heart still has, you know, 40 something HP and still does charges and still has zero defense, Bow is definitely the best option here. Bombet, not really. Um, Cooper, I've already upgraded. So it's either Bow, Gumbario, and Bombet. Yeah, you know, Bow is. I mean, Gumbario and charging, and, you know, that's that could be a thing that works, especially since this is a fight coming up that you can't get hurt. Um, I mean, I'm sorry, the partner can't get hurt in. But at the same time, though, I also need Bow to. Uh, for out of sight, which by the way is 4 FPA. I forgot it went up that much. Uh, so I can only really use that once. I mean, unless I heal. I could heal. That, that's always an option. Uh, that said, though, let's bow. I think this is a definite, definite uh, bow. I could actually use her spook to get rid of the, um, to get rid of the other enemies. The, um, the, Hyper Goombas, or whatever they are. Whatever they end up being that help out. That help out Tub of Blubba's heart. He'll take all my FP, but, you know, that's fine. Uh, do I want. I think I want to get caught. Yeah, you know, come on, catch me. I wanted to make it seem like I didn't want to get caught. Otherwise, we would have gotten suspicious. Probably. All right, we're just gonna stick to the wall here. Oh shit, oh shit, he's he's gonna get me. He's gonna carry me all of two feet out the door. That would have been horrifying. Um, aren't you normally sleeping? Um, so he's in front of the crack, right? See, that's how you do it, pro mode style. And this is how you do this room, pro mode style. And D down jump. And this is a freaking good badge. So it is going right on. And we'll most definitely see some use in this run. Especially since power bounce is trash now. Holy. Oh, look how fast he was moving. Um, why isn't this one easy to dodge? Oh god, he's gonna kill me. He's totally gonna kill me. He killed me. Uh. Well, Red Clubba, I salute you. I do. I'm gonna try running away again. Okay, this time I worked. I'm gonna let him walk away a little bit more. I thought it would be easy to run away from them if I got caught. But maybe it's because that one that I did run away from easily, he was uh, dizzied. Oh, this room. Oh, I remember this room was changed and made like 10 times more difficult. I'm just taking like a step and then moving. I mean, then invisibling. Step and then invisible. Step invisible. Are you kidding me? Okay, after many save states, I got it. You know, I may as well go for danger strats while I'm at it. Oh, except it does two damage. Hmm, huh, interesting. Um... Alright, we're just gonna sneak on by this little guy. Go up here. So we got two red clubbers. One of which is strategically positioned 
in front of this. Which is where I want to go because there is a very powerful badge here. A badge so powerful that it has been banned from all Paper Mario runs. Or should be. I mean, the partner one in T2ID is like banned from all Paper Mario runs. Or it should be. But it's not. Because people would get upset. I would get upset. Oh, let's equip Mega Rush 2 before I forget about it. And is there anything else I want to equip right now? No. Alright, so this dude is right in front of the door. Um, please hurry. Uh... So... I can actually beat him. You know what, I gotta heal anyway after this, so may as well. And there we go, I beat a red clubba. I don't want to fight you though. Sorry, Green Clubba, you're not worth it. Is Tubba Blubba a troll in this pro mode? Like, does he move like as fast as the Red Clubbas? I forget. Does move holy sh you went right through that door. You went right through the door. Fortunately didn't actually make it. Okay, let's just carefully walk past them. They're all sleeping. I have no reason to fight them, so I will not fight them. I will just sneakily get by them, get the castle key, and then sneakily get past them. Because I'm sneaky. While Danger Strats have served me well, it was time to heal back up. So I needed to get a key in order to unlock a chest, which gives me another key. A talking key, mind you, but still a key nonetheless. Actually, I'm sorry, with that key that I just got didn't unlock the chest, it unlocked the door to the hallway, which leads to the room, which has the chest, which has the talking key. My bad. Alright, let's just get out of here. I'm not a thief. I'm just taking what's rightfully mine. Hey, Tubba Blubby, you want to team up and help me beat up Bo so I can get my Star Spirit? I'll take that as a no. Guys, go up against the door. Stop him from breaking in. Or breaking out. He's going to break out and kill us all. That's right, sacrifice yourself for your queen and her plumber. Okay, let's try not to get hit here. I said try not to get hit, but I get hit anyway because that's just what I do. You know, actually, let me pick up this letter, if I can get it without getting stuck on anything. Let's unlock this door to the windmill. Now let's go and fight Tubba Blubba's heart. Let me just make sure, I want to make sure I have on, uh... Where's Lucky? Oh wait, all badges. Yeah, so in the last part, or two parts ago, whatever it was, when I was in Chapter 2, and I was looking for Lucky Stars, I... What happens is, right... I, I, I pressed to the right, and then I hit A, you know, in order to get to my badges. But when I hit right, I don't know why I hit right, but you don't even need to, but I hit right thinking that took me to the badges and hit A, but I hit down by accident, or like sideways right, which went down and hit the active badges, and that's why that happened. Anyway, I don't know why I'm explaining that, but that's, that's what happened there, if anyone was wondering. Uh, lucky stars. Put that on. 
and let's just hope for the best. I only have two life shrooms. Oh wait, actually it's in the next room. Only two life shrooms. The thing is, Tobolobo's heart can kill me in one hit, like, with its normal attack, if I don't guard it. Okay, so, hold on. So we got two of these, and, you know, I got double dip. So instead of spooking, I can... I can use, uh, double dip with Thunder Rage and Shooting Star. That works must be better than trying to spook them, because I also damage the heart. So, the Goombas are taken care of. You know, I was really expecting the heart to have, like, defense. Okay, so, gonna charge up. I'm going to use Maple Syrup, and then I'm going to use, uh, Out of Sight. Of course the curse is there, but the curse wouldn't have saved me from this attack. I would have gotten wrecked. Um, so let's see, let's... Let's just jump. There we go, that's a good curse. Ten damage. Nice. Now I'm going to use a maple syrup again. And I'm going to use out of sight. Curse is going to come, but again, it would not have saved me from this attack. This attack, the normal game does like Somewhere between 10 and 12, here we're due between 20 and 24, so... That curse ain't saving Mario. Would've been nice to see it there, though. Okay, defense. The curse did save Mario there. In fact, I'm just gonna leave Mario in danger. Because I may as well at this point. See? Look at that. Danger Mario is king. That should be it for the heart. Yeah. Alright, so beat the heart here. Now, I forget if Tubba Blubba was given like 50 HP. Or if that's just the, um, if it's just the super boss version that's, you know, given a lot of HP. Honestly, I didn't use any life shroom, so it's all good either way. Now, the only thing is I don't have FP. And I don't really have any way to get FP, so it's not a huge deal, but there is that. Alright, let's go fight Tubba Blubba. The real Tubba Blubba, not Tubba Blubba's heart. The living, breathing Tubba Blubba. Which I guess is the heart, too. Okay, so it does get a proper amount of HP. Um, Alright, I think Lullaby works well against him. Or not. Okay. Actually, that sucks, because I could have done some real damage. That actually sucks. Just wish I hadn't have wasted that lullaby. Lulla lulla lullaby. Wasted star power. That I could have used for refresh. Um, alright. Let's jump.
Defense, yes. Wow, with all that defense, he only did two. Actually, I'm gonna refresh that. Uh, actually, do I wanna refresh? Yeah, I'm gonna refresh, because if I can get back into danger, I can do some, some serious damage. And plus, with refresh, I also get back FP, which I can use for out of sight if I need to. Oh shoot, I forgot that attack's weaker. Um, Alright, I'm gonna use the Super Shroom. This fight's actually, like, a real mess. Um, yeah, not going well, but I think I should be okay. Yeah, I should be okay, because I'll get two more attacks with Bow at least. Yeah, we're fine. We are fine. Uh, power jumps should do more than normal jump. So let's do that. Actually, I think that did the same amount. So, no, I guess it didn't. Alright, I have a close call on and I have a pretty lucky. Please work. Good. Good. Um, I guess I'll just see. I just want to see what I would do with Power Bounce here. Seven. All right, I, would, I could do 10 damage with, you know, in danger against a zero defense enemy. So, that's something to keep in mind. It's two more damage than I would do with the normal jump. And if I get more attack power, it should be even more, so... It should be more of a difference. But, uh... All right. There we go. What's okay? For you to leave? Fine, good, leave. No, no, I thought you said you wanted to go and go back to your home and take a nap or not bother me. Shoot. Oh well. And we get Star Storm, which has been nerfed in pro mode, but... I mean, it's not terrible, but it's, it, it was really nerfed. Like, taking it from 4 to damage, I mean 7 damage down to 4 is, I don't know, it's just, I can't kill, like, stuff, I can't kill the Shy Guys in one hit with it. I guess it just gives me more of a reason to invest in stuff like, uh, like, uh, Thunder Rages and Shooting Stars and... Double dip, so I can use them combined to get enough damage for killing whatever I need to kill. You know, that stuff. Okay, and now we just have to answer some questions. So, guys, if you open your eyes right now, or Cam, if you look a little to the left, you'll see... You both are really late. Really, really late, and not very perceptive. Mario hates mushrooms. They're terrible. Thunder Rages make him make him very, very afraid. And super sodas, he hates how those taste. Actually, I think, um, I don't know if it's been one of them or both of them, but, or maybe all three, but where, I, I know the Koopa Troll one, it'll catch you even though I selected whichever one it is for that. And, um, you know, he'll make you fight him. Which I gotta keep in mind. I'm gonna forget by the time I get to it, but I gotta keep in mind. But when I get to it, I'm gonna forget, and then, you know, I'm gonna be like, oh wait, I forgot. And I won't be prepared. Okay, so now I gotta fight with Junior Troopa. Which actually, Power Jump might be the best bet against him. He's kinda tough, actually, I think, too. Let's fight him and, uh, and see what he's got. Gonna use Paracarry, I think Paracarry's the best bet. Best one to use against him. 
do wonder if he kills me in one hit. You know, hold on, maybe I should get life streams. Let me go get life streams first. I think I'm gonna get, like, five for this fight. And I'm also gonna take back out my Dizzy Dial. Because I'm pretty sure Dizzy Dial works well against him. Okay, so I've got Lucky Stars, I've got Life Shrooms. I should be able to do this in one try. I mean, I've also got, like I said, I'm gonna try the Dizzy Dials and just see what happens to. That's the only way I die, is if the Dizzy Dials, like, have, like, a very low chance and neither of them work. But, um, but other than that, I think I should be okay. Oh, you know, that's right, the dry, I forgot he has a Dry Bones with him, that's... That's adorable. Look at that, he has a friend. Now let's just get him out of the way. And... Then what we're gonna do is, uh... Dizzy Dial? Please work? Would be nice if you work here. Nope. But curse kicks in, and uh, hopefully that saves me because I'm about to get hurt. Oh, maybe he doesn't do that much damage. I, I don't know. Maybe he only does four. Well, maybe he does like six to seven, eight, something like that. Uh, okay. So let's try the dizzy dial one more time. There we go. One turn. One turn, great. One turn, one damage. I'm actually gonna let him hit me. Because I don't think he does more than like seven or eight damage. And then I'm going to destroy him with Danger Mario. Okay, uh, so he has defense, so D down jump is my best bet here. Plus the curse. Oh, this is going to hurt him a lot. Nice. And now hopefully he misses. And let's go for a Dean down and another look at that, another damage boost. I may not even need a life shroom after all. I may not even need it. Oh. Um Oh, that's cheating. Uh Junior Troopa, that's that's cheating. You're not allowed to do that. Oh, and he has more defense? Honestly, I think Troopa cheated. Just being straight up, like, he cheated. And now I'm gonna use... Refresh. Because I gotta use Airlift to get that Dry Bones out of there. Troopa should be dead here. Um, actually, I would have preferred not to have the curse. But, I guess I'll work with this. Um, well, I don't have FP. So, that's a problem, because I don't... Am I going to hurt him? Well, with the curse, I will. Junior Troopa, by putting me in danger, you have sealed your fate. Yeah, I was about to say, the, um, the, my health and FP and stuff, that wasn't showing up. But, looks like we're all good. 
make a save, and uh, actually I think I'm going to say that's the end of this part. Um, I'm going to continue on, I'm going to do what I'm going to do before Chapter 4 in the next part, and uh, maybe start Chapter 4, maybe not, I'm not sure, we'll see how long it takes, but uh, for now that's it, and I will see you next time.